वेलकम बैक टू माई YouTube चैनल हेल्दी लाइफ स्टाइल विद सायरा इन टू डेज वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट साइनस इन्फेक्शन इट सिम्टम्स कॉजिज एंड वेज टू ट्रीट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी नीड टू डिस्कस वट इज साइनासाइटिस साइनासाइटिस इज एन इन्फ्लेमेशन और स्वेलिंग ऑफ द टिश्यू लाइनिंग योर साइनसिस साइनसिस आर स्ट्रेक्च इन साइड योर फेस that are normally filled with air bacterial infections viral infections and allergies can irritate them causing them to get blocked and filled with fluid this can cause pressure and pain in your face nasal congestion and other symptoms symptoms of sinusitis common symptoms of chronic sinusitis include thick discolored mucus from the nose known as runny nose mucus down the back of the throat known as post nasal drip blocked or stuffy nose known as congestion this makes it hard to breathe through the nose pain tenderness and swelling around the eyes cheeks nose or forehead reduced sense of smell and taste other symptoms can include ear pain headache aching in the teeth cough sore throat bad breath and tiredness chronic sinusitis and acute sinusitis have similar symptoms but acute sinusitis is a short lived infection of the sinuses often linked to a cold the symptoms of chronic sinusitis last at least 12 weeks there might be many bouts of acute sinusitis before it becomes chronic sinusitis fever isn't common with chronic sinusitis but fever might be the part of acute sinusitis now i am going to explain the causes of sinusitis the causes of chronic sinusitis is usually unknown some medical conditions including cystic fibrosis can cause chronic sinusitis in children and teens some conditions can make chronic sinusitis worse these include a common cold or other infections that affect the sinuses viruses or bacteria can cause these infections a problem inside the nose such as deviated nasal septum nasal polyps or tumors risk factors of sinuses risk factors related to sinusitis are having a previous respiratory tract infection such as cold nasal polyps which are small benign growths in the nasal passage that can lead to obstruction and inflammation seasonal allergies sensitivity to substances such as dust pollen and animal hair having a weakened immune system due to medication or a health condition having a deviated septum the septum is the bone and cartilage that divides the nose into two nostrils when this becomes bent to one side either through injury or growth it can have sinusitis many people are confused about is sinusitis contagious or not sinusitis itself isn't contagious but the viruses and bacteria that can cause it are contagious remember to follow good hand washing practices avoid other people if you are sick and sneeze or cough into your elbow now the question is what happens if sinusitis is left untreated you don't necessarily need to treat sinusitis it often goes away on its own very rarely untreated sinus infections can lead to life threatening infections this happens if bacteria or fungi spread to your brain eyes or nearby bone home remedies to treat sinusitis in about 70% of cases acute sinusitis resolves without prescription drugs various home remedies and over the counter medications can relieve symptoms examples of these remedies and medications include nasal irrigation rinse and clear the nasal passages with a salt water 
or a saline solution a neti pot is one way to do this always use clean water and sterile equipment rest sleep or rest with head and shoulders raised on a pillow sleep with the pain free side of the face on the pillow if possible apply warm compress gently to the affected areas to relieve swelling and discomfort acetaminophen or ibuprofen can reduce pain and fever steam inhalation place a hot moist towel on the face or inhale steam from a bowl of hot water essential oils adding a few drops of menthol or eucalyptus oil to the hot water or towel may help never swallow an essential oil or apply it directly to the skin decongestant tablets and sprays decongestant tablets and sprays may reduce swelling and allow the sinuses to drain use for up to 3 days only or symptoms may worsen after stopping the use of the product decongestant tablets and sprays are available to purchase online over the counter nasal corticosteroids this type of nasal sprays may reduce nasal and sinus inflammation ways to prevent sinusitis the following tips may help prevent sinusitis practicing good hand hygiene avoiding smoking and second hand smoke keep vaccination up to date staying away from people with cold and other respiratory infections using a humidifier to moisten the air at home and keep it clean maintaining air conditioning units to prevent mold and dust from collecting avoiding and maintaining allergens when possible what are the best medications for sinus infection if you need an antibiotic which one your provider prescribes depend on your specific situation some options may include augmentin amoxicillin doxycycline levofloxacin cefixim cefodoxime and clindamycin this is all about sinus infection if you like my video please subscribe my channel and for any health related question and query you can ask in the comment section below goodbye